Welcome everybody, Red Arrow 23 here. Time for your War Factory preview for the 12th of January, 2017. Let's boom some beaches. All right guys, you're gonna have to excuse the sniffs and um, sniffles. I'm a little bit sick at the moment. You might, the throat might sound a bit weird as well. So I'm gonna try not to like be too loud or anything. But let's check out War Factory today. So our rewards, a lot of stone and iron, some prototypes. Hopefully that helps you out. And then looking at the beach is pretty well covered on the right side and the left side. So being a bit um, passive with your greens probably won't work too well today unless you bart something out first. This has got 128 health on it. Um, so that's probably a better bet. Taking out those two rocket launchers with bart before you launch grenadiers on the left side. Might even have to bite out some of these mortars as well. Um, yeah, and then tanks looking pretty hard as well. From the grappler and the boom cannons and the cannons, the shot blaster, the health on the core. We've got what is that? Four, five, six hundred. Um, thousand so that's not bad just thinking about warrior rushing um, 600k will probably need to be boosted um, to get it in one round of shocks because you need the flamethrowers these flamethrowers these flamethrowers oh they might be out of range maybe definitely the hot pot and the Doom Cannon is going to pick up a bunch as well as these shock launchers. Um, and you could get these machine guns and the shock blaster in one as well. <coughs> but we're going to use Zookas. I think it's the way to go. We're going to go for a two smoke landing just below these factory supplies. Up onto the wall. We're going to barrage out these mines first. And then I've got a few options um, depending on how much GB we arrive with. I think we're going to arrive with four shocks and that'll probably be our lot. So we can shock these machine guns, um, these mortars with this shot blaster and then these mortars with the rocket launchers or we might just go a little bit, yeah, we might get the shot blaster and all of these mortars, we're just going to go for both sides as long as we get there, that rocket launcher will be alright. And these mortars over here. And I got a couple of backup plans with Kratos in my head. So let's give it a go. Statues haven't changed from last week. So get our barrage in first. Starting with 115 GBE. Come on, get that last one. Uh, okay. You'll need to center your barrage a bit better than I did. Right. The moment of truth. So we're picking a little bit on the left side. Gonna let them gather up. And flare up and smoke quite close. Because that smoke was expiring. And we've got another peak there. So not the prettiest so far. We've got 53 GBE, which is not enough for, you know, let's flare on. Alright, let's go for that, 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 and that. Hammering the core. Have we got enough? Boom! That's our first War Factory solo. I love it. It's definitely my first War Factory solo. Um, I always hit War Factory unboosters, so I'm pretty stoked with that. 
I've been hunting it for a little while, lost 76 um, Zookas, so I'm pretty happy with that. Um, it could have gone a lot more perfectly, but definitely unboosted all Zookas solo, um, maybe boosted if you need more, more of the GBE, but definitely doable with 115. Um, yeah, so there you go, that's how you do it. Don't need to talk about it anymore. I love it. Probably going to be the shortest War Factory video I've ever done and cheapest I've never spent no diamonds before so that's awesome there we go War Factory preview for the 12th of January complete give us a comment down below how you took it out hopefully this video helped you out give us a thumbs up if you liked the video thumbs down if you didn't and subscribe for more Boom Beach